the WNBA draft was a great showcase for the upcoming superstars of the league. And Cameron Brink, as expected, went number two to the LA Sparks. For this video, we head into California. As expected, Cameron Brink from Stanford, the center, ended up going number two to the Los Angeles Sparks. And like I said yesterday, if you were able to check out the video, the LA Sparks had a top five defense, but they didn't have anybody to protect the rim, meaning they were able to help outside. But when it got to people getting close to lay up the ball and just hit close shots, they weren't able to stop that because they didn't have nobody that was able to block the shots. Now they have Cameron Brink coming in, who in my opinion, it would be cool if she can add just a little bit more weight to her frame. I think she's a little bit slender to play in that post. I think a lot of, of the bigs are going to try to get her and back her in like that, but I think she'll add just a little bit weight of weight and be able to be an exceptional center in the WNBA because the thing that she has, she can step out, she can knock down shots, she can hit threes, she can do a lot of different things that a lot of other people can't do. So it's definitely going to be um, very interesting to see what happens when she does get her opportunity to get on the court for the LA Sparks. And like I said, great pick by them. She's definitely going to come in and be an impactful player from day one. Will she start from day one? I'm not for sure. Uh, they probably will just let her come along slowly. But I can't wait till she get on the court and to watch her play. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section. Make sure I like the video and subscribe to the channel. And now I get to reorganize my bag. And thanks for watching.